Welcome back to the Brooklyn Brothers Cooking. Chef Dom is not here today, it's a Monday. The family decided they wanted some pasta primavera, so I went ahead and decided to make the video. But I got my two sidekicks here, my son Dominic and his friend Sean. And this is what we're gonna show you how to make. Pasta primavera. It's, what does primavera mean, guys? Spring. That's right, these are spring vegetables. All right. Let's get cooking. Welcome back to the Brooklyn Brothers Cooking. The family felt like having some pasta primavera. So I'm gonna go ahead and whip it up. And at the same time, I'm gonna show my son, Dominic, who's at the camera right now, his friend, Sean, how to make this pasta hey. primavera. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, these are the vegetables that we're gonna use today. You know, there are over 30 different types of spring vegetables, but we're gonna use just some asparagus, bell peppers, some red onion, and some uh, yellow squash. I got the water boiling. So we're gonna start off by cooking the pasta first. I'm gonna go ahead and make these farfalla pasta or bow tie pasta for the dish. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, cook this pasta. First, we're gonna put about two tablespoons of salt in the water. You don't want your pasta bland. And we're gonna go ahead and cook this for about 10 to 12 minutes. All right, we're gonna start cutting up these veggies here. Start out with the asparagus. I'm gonna cut them about an inch long. You don't want to get too far to the, you don't want to get too close to the bottom. You want to discard those or you can make some uh, veggie broth with that. Now we're going to go ahead and cut up these uh, yellow squash. First I cut them in half and then you just go ahead and slice away. Okay, you can cut. Yeah, it's gonna slice up these uh, bell pepper in little strips. We got orange and red bell pepper. Give us a nice color, plus the sweet, sweet peppers. They go really good with this dish. What are you how's doing? That, how's, that hey. pasta, how's that pasta coming along? It's coming along good. Good. All right, veggies are just about done. I'm gonna cut up these red onion, julienne style. All right, veggies are ready. Now we're gonna go ahead and roast them. Now we're gonna go ahead and roast these veggies. You wanna make sure you got a big enough pan. If you don't have a big pan, split up uh, the veggies in two different pans. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the asparagus, onions, Break them all up. Red peppers. Red peppers, that's right. Now we're gonna throw the squash. <laughs> all right, now what we wanna do with this is we wanna season it with a little sea salt. Black pepper, yeah, buddy. And then I'm gonna sprinkle some dry basil on there. For the added flavor. That's right. And we've got our extra virgin olive oil. I'm gonna head and drizzle all over the veggies. Then we wanna mix them up by hand. You wanna make sure all the veggies are coated with olive oil. So this way, they don't dry up as they're roasting in the oven. Did you wash your hands? Of course. Okay. That'd be unsanitary. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Okay, veggies are good. Now I've got the oven preheated to 450 degrees. I'm gonna go ahead and roast these for about 20 minutes. Pasta's ready. You're making the pasta. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and drain it. And then as soon as the veggies are ready, we're gonna go ahead and start the primavera. All right, let's check out these veggies. See how they're cooking. Oh, very nice. 
vegetables. Yeah, buddy. That looks good, don't it? Look at that. It smells great, too. All right, we're gonna whip up some garlic bread to go with this primavera. It's time to make bread, yes. I'm gonna go ahead and just slice these right in half. Put them on my seasoned pan. All right, I've got my extra virgin olive oil here. We're gonna have to baste these or apply this, apply this olive oil, this extra virgin olive oil. I wanna be liberal with oil here, but oil. You get a nice coating. Yeah. All right, now we're gonna have to put some fresh garlic on top. Sprinkle that on there. We need salt. We got some sea salt here. All right, and some Italian parsley. Spread that up, nice. All right, those are ready for the oven. All right, it's been 20 minutes. Now I'm gonna go ahead and remove the roasted veggies. Ah, oh, look how beautiful those are. Now I'm gonna finish beautiful. these off in this Dutch oven here. I went ahead and uh, heated up this Dutch oven a bit, just so we could start cooking real quick. What if the blood of pepper dropped? Uh-oh. Save that for the dog. Where is Rosie anyway? Okay. All right. I'm gonna hit it with some wine. Let that wine stick out. I'm going to put some chicken broth in it. About a cup. Let that cook for a minute. Now we're going to add our heavy cream. Perfect. this come to a boil and then we're going to add the bow ties all right <clears throat> cream is boiling now we're going to go in and add the bow ties and then we're going to let this cook up a little bit more cook that cream up a bit oh, it smells great already <laughs> soak it in the vegetables and the sauce oh yeah So pretty. Okay. All right. Now we're gonna go ahead and add the cheese. No, first the little black peppers. A couple of pinches of black pepper. Let's throw that in there. Yeah, buddy. And then I got about a quarter cup of uh, grated Romano cheese. Lucadelli. Favorite. Go ahead and mix that all in the pasta. Oh, it makes it nice and thick and creamy. I'm gonna turn it off and just let it cook out. Perfect. All right, ready to eat. Let's plate this beautiful pasta primavera. Look at that. How does that look, Sean? 
Amazing. How does it smell? Great. <laughs> <laughs> Good. I'm blessed. <laughs> Soon I'll ask you how it tastes. Well, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Like I said, folks, you can use any vegetable you like for this. Peas work great. I like artichokes in there. Some people like spinach, broccoli, carrots. It's whatever vegetables you have on hand or whatever you prefer. And that's it. Pasta primavera. Oh, look at that. <laughs> All right, try my best. We got pasta from a barrel. Let's check it out. Let's start out with grandma first. Bye. I'm gonna make you the guinea pig. Oh. <laughs> I know. There you go. It looks good. There's some cheese. Let me have your plate, huh? Dominic, next. Let's try this. Delicious. You want some cheese? Is it good, Sean? Yes. Put some more cheese on it. It'd be even better. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh. <laughs> so good. Dominic, some cheese? Yeah. I guess. How about a piece of bread there, Sean? <laughs> some real garlic bread. The real garlic. <laughs> Mama wants some bread? Mm -hmm. That's so good. Thank you. Welcome. So did you learn anything today? I learned how to make pasta primavera, is that what it's called? Pasta primavera. Pasta primavera. Awesome. Spring pasta. Yes. Wow. This came out really good. Yeah, I do say so myself. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, folks. We appreciate the subscribers, and we'll see you guys next time. Hey, don't forget to hit that notification bell, so this way when we have a new recipe come out, you'll be notified. Anyway, thanks again. Ciao. See ya.